Welcome to episode seven seventy nine. Patrice Morsepe, nine lessons. This is an outline of episode seven seventy nine. Lesson one to lesson five. This is lesson six to lesson nine. Lesson one: He was born a Taswana prince. His father was of royal Taswana descent. His grandfather, from his mother's side, is from Scotland. In 2020, the Mosapis are becoming the new royalty of South Africa. Is a picture of his sister, Chimpo Mosape, now First Lady of South Africa. His other sister, Bridget, in this picture, also made a huge fortune in mining. Lesson two: His families are entrepreneurs. My father was a teacher before he went into business. So. My father used to wake us up at five o'clock in the morning, and we would get onto in in a truck, and go and buy fruits and vegetables from the market in Pretoria. Lesson three: His three recipes for success: hard work, sacrifice, and perseverance. And for those to whom money is important,、uh, through hard work and sacrifice, you will succeed. More than、uh, Patrice、uh, and various others have in the world. Just work hard, sacrifice, and and persevere. You will succeed. You will. Lesson four: Start small. His first company, Future Mining, clean gold dust, which provided contract mining services that included cleaning of gold dust from inside the mine shafts for the Val Reefs gold mine. Lesson five: His innovation is profit sharing for workers. And implemented a system of worker remuneration that combined a low base salary with profit sharing bonus. Lesson six: Creative financing. He purchased for seven point seven million dollars with no money down and based on future earnings. Mines from Anglo Gold under favorable finance terms. Anglo Gold sold Motsepe six gold mine shafts at seven point seven million dollars, allowing him to repay that debt out of the future earnings of the company now known as African Rainbow Minerals. Lesson seven: Gold price rebound. Let's take a look at this graph. He purchased in nineteen ninety four when gold was around four hundred dollars an ounce. Then the price of gold quadrupled. He was at the right place at the right time. In 2013, he became a billionaire. Tris Musabe was the world's first black African billionaire. Lesson eight: diversification. Now, diversification of his business from gold mining to conglomerate. His new company is called African Rainbow Capital, which controls. Forty other companies in various sectors. As a nine, the charity king of Africa. He also broke the African record of charity in 2013 when he joined the Bill Gates and Melinda Foundation. Pledges to give half his wealth to charity. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace. And prosperity.